Okay, so in this video, we're going to make sure that our motors are spinning in the correct direction. We're going to be working on this motor right here. And remember, we want the, the props to spin towards the north-south line. So this is the north-south line of the drone. And so we want our prop to spin towards the north-south line, like this. And then on this motor, which way do you think we should spin it? I'll pause like this is Dora the Explorer. That's right, we want it to spin in this direction. Towards the north-south line. Okay, so, all right, so the first thing we're going to do is put on the prop to the motor. Now, you don't necessarily have to do this, but it makes it easier to see which direction the motor is spinning. If you do decide to put the motor on, make sure to only go up on the throttle very, very slightly. Very slightly. This is actually probably very ill-advised to put the prop on, but if you go up very slightly on the throttle stick, you should be fine. Secure down that prop with that little top there, that nut, that black top. And then we're going to connect the signal wire of this motor to channel 3 of our receiver, like we've been doing. Okay, so let's first turn on our transmitter. And then we will plug in our battery to the drone. Make sure our throttle stick is down right now. Okay, now let's barely press up on the throttle stick. And we see the motor is actually spinning this way. So away from the north-south line. Let's do it one more time. So it's spinning uh, counterclockwise and we want it to be spinning clockwise. So how do we fix that? Well, we're gonna flip the drone upside down. So all you need to do is connect the two of the blue wires to different black wires. So let's undo two of these bullet connectors. Okay, and then we'll plug them into the bullet connector that they weren't plugged into previously. So we're just switching two of those wires. And then we'll flip it back over. Now, if we press up on the throttle, this prop should be spinning towards the north-south line like, th like this, clockwise. All right, there we go. Now it is spinning clockwise. So perfect. So this motor has been fixed. So now that we know that the motor spins in the correct direction, we can put some electrical tape over the bullet connectors and make sure that those bullet connectors don't touch each other and they don't short out. Now you could also put some heat shrink around these bullet connectors, but my preference is electrical tape. So We'll just flip the drone back over. And again, you only want to do this if you know that the motors spin in the correct direction. Because if you don't know that, you might have to undo all that tape. All right, now these bullet connectors can come in contact with each other, but they won't actually short out because they're covered with an insulator. So you'll do that process for each one of the motors. Now the motor might actually be spinning in the right direction already, in which case you don't need to switch two of the bullet connectors. You're just, all you'd have to do is take some electrical tape and go right to covering the bullet connectors because they're already configured correctly.